Jay McCullough reporting live. It is Saturday morning. How you doing? That's She's good. Uh, we already gave Emma some of this. We we stopped. No. No. Okay. We stopped over to Roomba's Cafe. I want to say in the Jersey City Heights. Excellent stuff going in there. This is the breakfast platter number three. We've got two pieces of bread. Emma loves those. Got an extra egg for seventy-five cents. This whole thing's going to set you back about seven fifty, seven ninety-five. These are over easy. We were in the car for about fifteen minutes. Look at that. Perfectly runny yolks. And it even comes with OJ. But also comes with OJ, but not, they have fresh squeezed OJ, but that's not what you're getting for the breakfast special. They're just giving you basically tang. So we usually don't get that, but can't pass up the cafe con leche. This is absolutely delicious. Would you, no, no coffee for the baby. So we've got that. We've got the green mashed plantains with some great onions here. We've got two slices of queso blanco, I believe. And then two of this is like the Dominican salami. Uh, ex absolutely excellent stuff. And um, uh, normally we'd have like the El Yucateco, the habanero, the green sauce, but we have the Bronx Green Market hot sauce. We also keep the red. Yeah. In the, la, it is la, it is spicy. So we're just gonna throw a little bit. Whoa. Oh, that's a. This just came out of the closet, the pantry, because we, we went through the previous one. So put a little bit on that. The, the bread is fantastic. Mm. And you can make yourself a little sandwich here. It goes really well with Emma. Getting the extra egg, I think, is going to be the game changer. Because we usually we usually run out of the eggs. Isn't that right, Cynthia? No, I, I thought we were good on the eggs. Oh, I always have extra extra no, plantains. We usually have some leftovers and we crack a new some egg. Salami or something. Mm. The eggs are excellent as well. And uh, really, the green plantains. This is... Well, you're not getting, um, I guess down by, down by the pass station, what's the place that we go? La Casa. Mm, yeah. the closest you're getting this in Hoboken. And uh, La Isla, really, does, that's a Cuban breakfast. It's very different. They do sandwiches. And we also stopped over at Dolce de Leche Bakery. And let me show you what you're getting for 10 bucks when you go into Dolce de Leche Bakery. One in Jersey City Heights. Um, there's a few more in, uh, I believe, Northburg and Union City. This is, if I could just, oh, they really taped it down here. Hey. It may be cake. Emma thinks this is cake, but it's actually yeah. going to Harry Kalsas this evening and bringing, these are always a hit. This, this, these are basically a buck 15 each. You're getting guava and cheese here. Those are the best. These are, these are stuffed with a, um, another sweet, I think a vanilla custard. Um, there's, there's basically four different varieties here. Um, what a spread up there, let me tell you. And they even have savory items. We got some chicken salad, some egg salad sandwiches. I was very excited. Oh, we have we have two for you. They're in the bag. We're gonna crack these open. So these are for the party. Okay. So we're not gonna we're not gonna eat those. Uh, but Cynthia did want her own guava, guava and cheese. And do you mind if I just take a bite of this? This is no, it's fantastic. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. I'm gonna get a full bite. Hachima. Oh, loves the mean mouth. This is and Cynthia's taking that one. So, Jersey City Heights, quick breakfast, Memorial Day weekend, you guarantee to get a parking space when you get back here. It was a bit of a walk, it was raining out, so we, we took the car. But uh, highly recommend, and you can order in advance on here, um, but it does help to review the menu because the breakfast platters are just numbered, they don't tell you on the menu what they are. But if you're going there, you're gonna probably want the number three, and maybe hold the OJ unless you wanna try it for the first time. But that's it, have a great breakfast, and have a good weekend, bye-bye.